<laughs> but you know, kidding aside, I want to say I'm here uh, because I want to tell you something that happened to me. Because I see that a lot of you are young women. Some of you are going to be finishing high school, going on to college. And uh, I'm going to tell you something that, that happened to me in college that a lot of people don't talk about. I went to the U of M, Twin Cities campus, and uh, they have a campus connector bus. I take the bus every day. I was in my uh, third year, and it was a wintry day. And I was sitting there on the bus, and there were a bunch of guys behind me. They happened to be you are my age, college students. They happened to be um, young white men. And we were at a red light, right across from Moose Tower. And I remember they looked out the window, and to their left, there was a young Asian American woman standing leaning across the street. And they said to each other, have you had that kind of woman? And the other guy said, who? What kind of woman? Right there, look at her. Have you had that kind of woman? Have you slept with that kind of woman? I have. She, those kind of women, they'll do anything you want them to do. And I turned around and I looked at them. I looked at them to say, you know what? I hear you. I'm Asian American. I'm offended. If I were you, I would just stop it right now. I looked at them, and they looked at me. And they kept talking. All the way from Moose Tower, all the way across the bridge, right over to where Carlson School of Management is. And they kept talking. He kept saying, you know what? Yeah, I was at a party, and I, met, and I met that kind of girl, and she was like, you know what? We love you a long time. I would do anything for you. Do you want to get with me? Yeah. She's easy. I'll get with any kind of girl. That girl will get with anyone. And I stood up when my staff came, and I looked around, and no one said anything. And I looked at them, and I said to them, what kind of classes are you guys taking? What kind of class are you taking? You must be taking the wrong one. Because you know what? You wouldn't say that kind of stuff. You should be damn lucky that I have a class to go to. Because if I didn't, I would kick your ass right now. And they stared at me. And you might think like I felt really good. Like I felt, oh yay. I want, you know what? I looked around the whole time. Nobody said anything. Nobody said anything. You know what's the worst feeling? Is when nobody else stood up for you. That's the worst, that's the loneliest feeling. And I'm here today because I want to make sure that Hmong American women, the women of color, women everywhere, that we're focused on being the best people that we can be. We're not focused on wondering when we're going to be sexually harassed based on our gender and based on our age and based on our race. How am I supposed to focus on the next class if I'm wondering when some guy wants to sleep with me? And I'm here because I don't want you, and I don't want you, and I don't want you, and I don't want you, I don't want you to go through that. And I'm glad that you guys are here today. Thank you.